Have you ever thought about moving to Foxborough, Massachusetts? Well, if so, then you're gonna to wanna to watch this because that's exactly what I'm about to talk about. My name is Heather Lobinger, and I'm a realtor here in Massachusetts. I work for Real Living Suburban Lifestyle, and I also happen to be a resident of Foxborough myself. So I'm just gonna quickly go over five of the reasons why I love living here and why you might too. So the first reason why I love living here is the local area attractions. I think it pretty much goes without saying that we are known to be home of the New England Patriots, so we have Gillette Stadium, of course. Gillette Stadium not only hosts the Patriot games, but they also are, they host Revolution soccer games, and they also have a variety of concerts throughout the year, and they also do a bunch of family-friendly activities, so it's just a really cool spot to have here in town. Um, Gillette Stadium is located at Patriot Place, and Patriot Place has a ton of shopping, restaurants, there's a movie theater there, there is a bowling alley there, just a ton to do and just a really, really cool place to have, again, to have here in town. Um, some of the other things that I love here in Foxboro for the attractions are we have a state park that has a lot of really great hiking trails and walking trails, and we also have a campground here in town, which I have not been to yet, but I, that is on my list of things to do. The second reason why I love living here in Foxboro is the school systems. They are very highly rated and there are three elementary schools, there's one junior high, one high school, and everything I've heard from local residents is just nothing but really, really great things about the school systems. So as a parent, I have two toddlers and that's a very important thing for me. So great school systems here in Foxboro. The third reason why I love living here is the location. The commute to Boston is only about 40 minutes you also could go to Providence, which is like a 30 minute drive. So it's cool that you're kind of centered in between the Boston city and then the Providence city if you are working in either, either of those cities and planning to commute. Um, and we are about 40 to 45 minutes to the closest beach. So if you like beaches, that's not a terrible, terrible commute for a little beach day. And we also have a commuter rail at Gillette Stadium, as well as very close commuter rails in surrounding towns. So if you didn't wanna drive, you wouldn't have to drive far to hop on that commuter rail to get to, to get to a local city. The fourth reason why I love living here in Foxboro is to me at least, it has a very suburban feel to it, um, but you still have plenty of going on around you. Of course, depending on which part of Foxboro you end up purchasing in, but in my opinion, it has a very suburban feel to it. Um, and I just like that I don't have to drive super far to kind of be at the center of things to be, you know, where Patriot Place is and um, where there's shopping and restaurants and all that fun stuff. And the fifth reason why I love living in Foxboro is the food and beverage situation. There is not a shortage of amazing restaurants here in Foxboro. You can find a bunch up at Patriot Place, but you could also find them just scattered throughout Foxboro. There's a lot of family owned restaurants that are absolutely amazing and you, you just really can't go wrong. You're, you're not gonna move to Foxboro and have a lack of awesome places to go grab a drink or a bite to eat. So that is it for me. Those are the five reasons why I love living here in Foxboro and why you might too. And if you happen to live here already, I would love if you would comment below and let me know your favorite parts about living in this town, whether it's your favorite spot to grab pizza or just in general, your favorite thing to do in town, why you love living here too. So thank you so much for watching and make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you don't miss the next town that I will be talking about next week. I hope everybody has a really, really wonderful weekend.